here we're taking a look at adding and subtracting fractions. So in this particular problem, we're subtracting. We have 3 over 5 minus 1 over 10. So again, we can see the denominators are different. We have 5 and 10. So we need a common denominator. So we can do that a number of ways. Here's one particular way. Write out the multiples of the denominators we have. So 5, we have 5, 10, 15, 20, so on. 10, we have 10, 20, 30, so on. So the first common one we see is 10. So that means 5 and 10 will both divide into 10 evenly. So we're converting our fifths to tenths. So we're converting 3 over 5 into whatever it is over 10. So 5 into 10 goes twice. 2 times 3 is 6. So that means 3 over 5 is the same as 6 over 10. Here, 10 into 10 goes once. 1 by minus 1 is still minus 1. So if 6 minus 1 over 10 gives us 5 over 10. At this point, we're not yet finished. We have an answer of 5 over 10, but that's not it in its lowest form. We can break that down further. If we divide above and below by 5, 5 into 5 goes once, 5 into, fo five into 10 goes twice. So 5 over 10 is the same as 1 over 2. So our answer here is 1 over 2. So whenever we add or subtract fractions, we first have to make sure that we have the same denominator. So if the denominators are different, we have to get a common denominator and convert the fractions to that. Then we can do our addition or subtraction. Here's another example of subtraction. So again, we can see the denominators are different, 7 and 14. So at this point, you might be able to do it in your head, figure out what the common denominator is. But if not, just write out the multiples and whichever one is common first. That's the one we use. So for 7, we have 7, 14, 21, 28, and so on. 14 is 14, 28, 42, and so on. And you can see straight away the first common one is 14. So our common denominator would be 14. So we're converting 2 over 7 into whatever it is over 14. So 7 to 14 goes twice, 2 twos are 4. So that means 2 over 7 is the same as 4 over 14. Here we have 3 over 14. 14 to 14 goes once, 1 by minus 3, still minus 3. So it's 4 minus 3, which is 1 over 14. And that's our final answer.